Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another eBay finds. In today's video, I'm super excited because I have some really fun stuff to show you guys. If you can already guess by the title, I am going to be swatching the Kylie Matte Liquid Lipsticks and Lip Liners. These are obviously fakes. These are not the original ones and I do want to give a quick disclaimer before we start. The first thing that I want to say is that I do not own any of the original Kylie lipsticks and second of all I know that it's such a pain in the butt to get her products so I'm all my got time for that so I haven't even tried so I don't have the original ones to compare them with but if you guys have them I'm sure you can tell and I will try to do my own research as far as pictures and I will be letting you guys know which ones I think are closer to hers there's definitely some on here that I just don't think are dupes at all they're totally off and I also have another thing that I want to show you guys so with that said Let's get started into this video, shall we? So the first ones that I wanted to show you guys are these. These are the Kylie lip glosses. So when I first saw these on eBay, I thought, okay, these are supposed to be lip glosses. These are called Like, Literally, and So Cute. Unfortunately, when I got them in the mail, they are matte lipsticks which first of all I ain't mad at because they are really pretty but I was pretty upset that they are not glosses because that's why I got them so this was the first order that I placed so I'm going to be doing swatches let's talk about the first one like is a very pretty peachy color again these are not glosses these are going to be liquid lipsticks which it's not bad but I was hoping that I would get a lip gloss these do dry completely matte and they don't budge they're actually a pain in the ass to remove so you have to be very careful when you remove them because you can hurt your lips the second one that I have is literally and literally it's pretty close to like but this one has more of a peach undertone and this is definitely my favorite one and then the last one that I have is so cute now so cute is very 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 light which for my skin tone, I just can't get away with this color on my lips. It looks like I'm like thirsty. I look like I'm a thirsty bitch. So I totally can't get away with this color. As you can see, it's very light, especially right now that I'm super tan. I just, I this color, I cannot wear it. So now these have dried down pretty much completely and that is what they look like matte. Again, these don't budge. They are very long lasting and they actually smell pretty decent. I believe I paid $6 for all three of them which is not that bad and I got them within about two weeks of me order ordering them. I cannot say that word. Of me ordering them. Now the second order that I placed was for her actual liquid lipsticks and I have all eight of them. I know she has more but these are the ones that I have. Now from what I've noticed and as far as the packaging, the packaging is actually pretty accurate. It has Kylie's name, it has her little XOXO signature on the back, it has all the ingredients and Kylie's tips, everything. The only difference from what I know is the teeth. So as you can see, the grill that it has on here, Kylie's when you move it around, it kinda, you can see like that greedy effect. I'm not sure how to, how to say it because again, I don't own any, but these don't, they're just plain. It might look like it on the camera, but it doesn't. So I'm gonna go ahead and swatch all these for you guys, so. Let me start off by saying that True Brown K is not, not anything like the lipstick that I seen Kylie Jenner wear. I know that it's a very dark brown and this is not. Now these, I got them eight for $23, so I'm not sure how much that comes down to. Let me do the math real quick. We divide $23, you get them for about $2.87 a piece. I believe that's how much I paid for them. Let me check my eBay. I'm not I'm not sure how much I paid, but I know that it was around $20. Yep, so $8 for $23. Eight pieces for $8. What? Eight pieces for $23, and you also get a lip liner. That is True Brown K. That is the liquid lipstick. This is the lip pencil. The lip pencil and the color are totally different. 
from what I can see on her pictures and other gurus pictures on Instagram this is supposed to be more of a dark brown and this is definitely more of a cool tone brown and when you apply it in the lips it's pretty but it's not the color that it's supposed to be now this one is candy K so that is the lip pencil of Candy K and the liquid lipstick of Candy K. Let's do Mary Jo K next. Now this one, I must say, I was very, very impressed. The pigmentation is amazing and the color is just so gorgeous. That is a lip pencil, like I said, very pigmented. And that is the liquid lipstick. I mean, look at that pigmentation. The lip liner is definitely more on like the cherry side and this is like a hot, watermelon really just pretty red that American true red with blue undertones very pretty and it wears so nicely on the lips so this one's Mary Jo K and I really like this one now this is Posey K and from what I can see this is supposed to be more of a mauve lipstick and it's definitely not so this is Posey K the lip liner that is Posey K right there I do have to say that Posey K is definitely more streaky. You have to apply it a few times. So in general, I would just say, unless you really like this color, I would say to skip on this one because it's very patchy and it's very streaky. And it's just, it doesn't look that nice on the lips, honestly. Next, we have one of the ones that I was really excited for, but I was very disappointed in. This is supposed to be Courtney K, and it's supposed to be like a dark, vampy lip. And this is the lip liner. That is the lip liner, as you can see, it's not as dark as it should be. So I guess depending on your skin tone, it will look different, but when I applied this one, it was again very streaky. Um, if I did this, I would definitely lose some color on the top or the bottom lip. So even though this is a really pretty color, it's a very nice color for um, fall that is coming up, but I just don't like it and it's not as dark as the original Court K. So again, I would definitely say just to pass on this one because it just, it doesn't apply good on the lips, so. Then we have 22. My lid actually got stuck, or the bottom of the lip pencil got stuck in the lid. So now I can't close it, but this is 22. And I like this one. I like the lip pencil better than the actual liquid lipstick. So this is the lip liner, and again, I absolutely love the lip liner. It looks pretty accurate to her liquid lipstick, but the liquid lipstick is more orange this one but the lip pencil is so pretty it's like come here to all your mamas out there don't trust your kids that they're being good and watching cartoons upstairs when they're out doing this what did you do Look at your arm. Ay, ay, ay. What happened? Daddy colored me. Mm, your daddy colored you? Mentirosa. So that is what it looks like dry. I feel like this one is pretty accurate to her 22 liquid lipstick. But again, let me know. So this is Coco K. Okay, there's like absolutely no pigmentation to this lip liner. Like nothing that is a lip liner there's nothing there i'm gonna throw this away and again coco k is totally off from what i can see it's supposed to be more of a baby soft nude and this is definitely more of a coral with some pink under it it is a very pretty color but it's just nothing like coco k the last one that i have here is dulce k and this is absolutely my favorite if you guys pick up any of these I highly suggest for you to get Dulce K it is so flippin gorgeous so this is the lip liner and this is the liquid lipstick and then the very last thing uh, that I wanted to show you guys and I'm just going to go over it really quickly because I'm sure this video is going to be really long I also found a dupe for the Sigma spa I actually got a little PR package sent to me from Sigma and they sent me this so this is their original one the Sigma spa and you're just supposed to put your hand like this and it tells you where to wash your brushes rinse refine etc etc but before that 
a few weeks before that I saw this on eBay and I honestly didn't even notice that it was Sigma until I got it in the mail I saw that it said Sigma I was like oh fine and it actually works exactly the same it's pretty much exactly the same thing as you guys can see on here they're very 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 similar the only difference is that the fake one is a lot smaller this is a big one and as you can see it's a lot longer and it's a lot bigger but everything is the same the little circles the little bolitas that it has on here so that is everything for today's ebay finds i really hope you guys enjoyed this video definitely give me a thumbs up if you did and let me know what other products you guys want me to pick up from ebay if you guys want to continue to see like comparisons of dupes because i've seen some on ebay and i have my eye on them so let me know if you guys want to see these kinds of videos because mama likes to go shopping that is all for today's video thank you guys so much for watching Please subscribe if you haven't, and I will see you guys on Friday. Love you guys. Bye.